Hey, Sarah. Hey, Pam. Hey, Amanda. I know. We're hoping for metallic Kool Aid jammers. Absolutely. Y'all want to see something cute? Oh, my heavens. That was not cute. I almost knocked over my shelves. Oh, boy. You want to know what is cute? Look at the pupper. Say hi, Charlie. Can you say hi, buddy? Good stretch. All right, ready? Come here. Charlie, sit. Good job. Good job, buddy. Good boy. <laughs> That's my dog. He's the cutest. I love him. Hi, Miss Sherry. All right, you guys. What do you want to open first? Comment below. We've got some Series 2, 3, and 4. Toy Series 2, Disney, and UK. What you feeling? He is so cute, but I'm also a little biased. I'm very biased. I love him very much. He's my baby. Hi, Janelle. We got, yeah, so if you hear squeaking, that's why. That would be my dog. He's playing with uh, his squeaky toys behind me. Hi, Wendy. All right, I see Series 3, Series 4. UK, Disney, whatever I see a duplicate of next is what we'll roll with. Hi, Janelle. Which one y'all wanna open? Comment below. UK it is. Here we go. Y'all know I love a UK. Okay, so the only way you know is it says Series 3 and it's the blue that looks identical to our Series 4. You unfortunately can't go out and buy these. Um, I just have a friend that does this for me. God bless that woman. And um, I'm super excited. Hi, Shirley. Shirley, gosh, I cannot talk tonight. Hi, Tegan. If I mispronounce your name or mispronounce anything, I'm sorry. I clearly can't speak this evening. <laughs> Y'all do me a favor and throw up a bunch of likes and your favorite emojis is good luck. We're hoping to find lots of UK exclusives. Here we go. I might have to rearrange myself a little bit here. If you're interested in any mystery grab bags, let me know. I'm doing them right now for a little time. It's $20 for 20 random minis, no duplicates, and it'll just have shipping, of course, depending on where you're located. Ready? Bam. You can just message me here or send me an email. Either one. All right, you guys. Jackie, when I saw yours at first, I saw a sloth and I was like, I'm not going that slow, Jackie. <laughs> All right, you guys, one through five, comment below which one you want to open first. <laughs> Hi, Lisa, how are you? I was like, I'm not opening any slower than normal, okay? <laughs> and then I realized what I asked you to do, so, you know, you follow directions. <laughs> All right, we've got Clean Sensations. I'm all right, Miss Lisa. Thanks for asking. All right, you guys, one through four. I miss my nails being done so bad. I hate looking in this camera and seeing my nails not done. They're just embarrassing. Just don't pay attention. Just pretend I have, like, nubs. That's we're, This is what we're going to pretend, okay? <laughs> one through four. Audra Lee, this is only the first thing that we've opened. Literally, that's the first pot. Like, the first little slice. That's it. You're good, girl. All right, let's do two. I like the sunglasses, Carrie. Two is a push pop. What is that word? Candy. I thought that said Carrie. I was like, what? All right, you guys. One through three. I know. Isn't it depressing, Jackie? I hate how it looks. Hey, Mentally Confused. I know. I just, I don't like that they're not done. Believe me. It's the worst. I hate not having them done. It's definitely sugar in a tube. You are correct. And we've got Wet Ones Hand Sanitizer. Cute little bottle. All right, you guys. One or two. One or two. Thank you, Brenda. Which one? I always feel like an eye doctor whenever I say that every time. You're good, Miss Audra Lee. I was actually late today. I jumped on late. I was slacking. The hand sanitizer's cute, isn't it, Kimmy? 
My favorite mini brand ever is my Briars Cookies and Cream Ice Cream, for sure. Number two is, oh, you guys! Oh my gosh, shut up! It's the Multi Cat Arm and Hammer. No way! It is a UK exclusive, and it's the one I wanted the most out of this series from UK. Yay! Oh my gosh, they're so cute! Lisa, I have indeed tried to do my own nails, and I miserably failed. Um, I have done them twice now, and every time, like, one little piece chips off, my OCD can't handle it, so I just, like, peel them, like, and I pull the whole darn thing off. So I haven't been able to find, like, a base coat that stays for whatever reason, and, like, I clean them before with, like, um acetone you know so that the nails not too much but I don't know like I buff them all that kind of good stuff because I always do gel nails I just I can't get them to stay I'm so excited it's so cute all right we got a checklist I don't see any money which not real money just play money and we've got Hershey's Kisses Almonds have you tried Holo Taco's base and top coat? So, Mom, I'm going to have to write that down and try it for later. I have no notepad near me. I have, like, a million pens and no notepads. That's not true. I have all of these little backpacks right here. Silly girl tricks are for kids. Look at this. Look at this. These backpacks came in handy. Oh, wait, no, I don't think this one has a... Oh, no, this one doesn't have a notebook. Just kidding. Which one of these does have a notebook? Maybe, maybe the avocado has a notebook. Does the avocado have a notebook? I don't see a notebook in the avocado either. You know what? I lied to myself. Apparently not. You got to make sure you prepare your nails correct before putting the coats on. So what I did is I, okay, so I clipped all my cuticles, right? Like I clipped all those off. Like I soaked them first and then clipped all my cuticles off. I mean, it's not now, obviously it's not good now, but this is like when I was trying to do it. And then I, um, buffed them and I filed them. And then I did like acetone to use this kind of like a dehydrator, you know, for the nail. And then I put a base coat. So maybe my nails are oily. I needed to hydrate it for, yeah, see, that's what I thought too. I was like, well, maybe that's what it is. So that's why I thought acetone would, you know, would serve as, as a dehydrator, but apparently not. I don't know. So I cut them all off cause I got mad the other day and <laughs> hi, Brittany. <laughs> so they were like pretty and long and I got frustrated. So I just snipped them all off. So <laughs> I guess I'll wait <laughs> until they grow back out. Yeah, I saw that. So I actually bought a nail works perfect for a dehydrator one part acetone one part rubbing alcohol oh that's smart it's just cc can you tell me what that other brand was that you said later at, like the end of the video um i will have to remember the acetone and the alcohol i do have rubbing alcohol it was it's just been a disaster i've tried to do them twice now and i i just it's not i'm not good at it i'm not artistic in that way i'm musically artistic i am not you know painting artistic just it's just not me i'm so excited about the kitty litter we're just gonna leave it here okay you guys what's next we've got series two three four and a toy series two what you feeling comment below yeah i'm just not good at doing nails i have not tried color street you know maybe that's what i need to do because i'm clearly never gonna get it right so here's the thing. I usually just get them done. I have absolutely zero issues paying for somebody else to do my nails. That is a luxury. But I lost my job. And so that's just something that had to go. You know, like that's that's a luxury. That's not something I need. So it's just something that I've had to deal with not having, which is really weird for me because I always have my nails done, which sounds like a silly thing. But it's just huh, it's been a couple weeks. It's been a rough couple weeks, so that was just something that, like, I'm used to getting done. So I'll definitely have to look at Color Street, I guess. Let's do Toy Series 2. Don't forget to follow if you haven't already. I am doing a giveaway at 200,000 followers. Hi, Aubrey. So make sure you do that and also subscribe here. You must do both. 
Anita, I appreciate it. I definitely know some people that have done it before that have reached out to me. And I was just kind of like, eh, I'm just going to go pay somebody to do mine. I do, Brittany. I play the clarinet, the tenor saxophone, the alto saxophone, and the baritone saxophone. Ready? Bam. Ooh, that one fell. And another one fell. All right, you guys. One through five. Which one do you want to open first? Your son plays the alto sax? That's awesome. I started out on clarinet and then my um, band teacher at the time was like, okay, uh, I need somebody on this instrument. Uh, you're good at what you do. Can you try it for me? <laughs> and it went, that's how it went. Hey, Jess, you want to hear me play one day? Oh, I don't know. I would have to go live during the day rather than at night because um, I, I don't think my neighbors would appreciate that. <laughs> I don't think they would like that at all. I think they get really annoyed. I mean, it's not that I don't play well. It's just a loud instrument. It's not a quiet instrument. First one, we got some toy mini brand bags. Oh, I love the flute. I uh, One of my really good friends plays the flute, and we used to trade instruments all the time just for fun. All right, you guys, one through four. Yep. I did a um, marching band, I did tenor saxophone, and alto saxophone, and technically I did clarinet at some point too, so. I swapped around, but I was always a clarinet during concert season. And then I played baritone saxophone for jazz band. So. We got a checklist. And we have Zero Smashers Lava Slime Surprise. Do I like and or play sports? No. I, um, well, okay. Let me rephrase that. One through three, guys. Whichever one you'd like. I'm not really a huge sports person. I just, it's just not my thing. Now, my husband, on the other end, is a fanatic. So, of all the sports that he likes to watch, I actually do enjoy hockey. I love going to a hockey game. That's really fun because it's fast-paced. So, it doesn't get boring. Um, playing sports, I played basketball growing up. Up until, up until my sophomore, I played through my sophomore year of high school. Oh, I appreciate, listen, a parade is on another level. Like it's, we, yeah, I'm telling you, I almost died going up some of those hills <laughs> during marching parades. We got a Jojo Siwa doll. All right, you guys, one or two. Yeah, hockey games are fun for me just because it's it's a quick paced thing. Yeah, and marching like band camp. Oh my gosh, so much sweating, dude. And those you get those tan lines for like the rest of the year too. I'm telling you, they just they just don't go away. And we got some create and colored pencils from Crayola. I can hear my cat. My cat is meowing. I'll have to let him in after this one. And we got Beat the Parents. All right, you guys, what's next? We've got Toy. Nope, just kidding. We've got Series 3 and 4. No, 2, 3, and 4 in Disney. What you want to open? I absolutely love Marching Band. I would do it all over again in a heartbeat. It was one of my, it was really the only thing I liked about high school. Truthfully. Come on. Come on. Come on. Okay, now we got the cat. Anybody want to see a cat? You can also see my face momentarily. Hang on, let me see if I can find the flippy button. I forget how to do this. Because I never, like, try to show you guys my face. Can I double tap it? Nope, that's not it. Enhance? Yeah, that's it. Oh, Lord. Ignore my hair. Puma! Here's the kitty. Can you say hi? Puma. He's pretty unhappy that I just picked him up like that. 
What you doing, buddy? Ignore my hair. Are you handsome? Are you a handsome boy? Hmm? Wanna say hi? This is Puma. He's my first fur baby ever. I'm pretty much the only person that he tolerates picking him up. If anybody else picks him up, it is screaming. He will absolutely scream. Uh, Charlie's right here. He just doesn't fit in my lap. Yeah, he was not thrilled. Here's Charlie. Here's the Charlie baby. Yes, and I know. You want to play. I know. You're so cute, too. He's just, he's trying so hard. Look at that face. Look at that face. Oh, you're such a good boy. You're so handsome. You're such a sweet boy. Are you handsome? Are you handsome? <laughs> oh, I just knocked my door. All right, you guys, what's next? He is such a good boy. All right, you guys want to open series two, three, four, or Disney? I will play with him after. Charlie is such a good boy. Does your cat need a girlfriend? <laughs> no. He's so, I do. I do have two kitty cats. He's um Fuzz Fuzz is probably laying with my husband. I'm too loud when I'm in here. Like I get excited and like when we open something new, I squealed with you guys. Like it that's not Fuzz Fuzz's thing. He does not like loud at all. I'm way too loud while I'm in here. Puma is goofy. So he doesn't mind the yelling. He's just he wants in he can't stand when I shut the door. So, like, if my husband shuts the door to anything, he doesn't care. He doesn't pay attention. But if I shut the door, he starts crying. So that's why he's in here. Yeah, you should totally be able to find some of these at Walmart. I don't think all of them, but some of them, yeah. If you check out my Amazon storefront, it's got all of them listed. All right, we got a series two, wave two. We are hoping, I did. I do collect Minnie's fashion um, for the metallic Kool-Aid jammers. So throw up a bunch of emojis as good luck for me. We've been looking for over like a year. Yeah, Puma freaks out when the door is closed. He, will, he cries and shoves his paws under the door and screams. I have not been able to find many fashions too. I did look the other day. Although, to be honest, it kind of doesn't matter right now because I really shouldn't be buying it anyways. Like, I'm hoping that I have enough back stock of toys to open with you guys until I get my um, next job. So, we'll have to see. <laughs> That's part of the reason behind the Mr. Grab Bags, too. All right, ready? Bam. All right, you guys. One through five. Comment below on which one to open first. But then Puma cries when I don't open the door to let him out. So he's a goober. All right. Let's do five. We have golden crinkles. French fries. Yum. All right, you guys. One through four. I love the little kitty cat. Kitty litter. I did, Stephanie. It was less than exciting. It has not been a good couple weeks for me. <laughs> I try to keep my page pretty positive, though, so I just haven't really talked about it. All right, let's see. Let's do two. It's okay. I appreciate it. Things happen. Hi, Iris. We got some Stubbs barbecue sauce. All right, you guys. One through three. Yeah, I definitely agree. <laughs> they have been, but that's okay. It gets better. 
If it never rained, there would never be rainbows. And we got some Classico Creamy Alfredo. One of my favorite um, quotes that one of my friends told me was, when it rains, it pours. But if it never rained, then we would never see rainbows. It's one of my favorite phrases. All right, you guys, one or two, one or two. I feel like an eye doctor every time. It's a good one, Meg. It's a good one. And we got some Maxwell House coffee. Our house in the middle of our house. Thanks, Allie. I appreciate it. We got a checklist. And some Italian, zesty Italian dressing. All right, you guys, what's next? We got series three, four, and Disney. What you want to open? Which one you thinking? Which one? Which one? Four it is. Here we go. I love series four. They've done a great job. I love the combination of personal products and food. series is included in my grab bags oh whoops dropping things um series two three four disney and then toy series one and two all right you guys one through five hi puma Number three, checklist. I don't see any money. Not real money, just play money. And we got a Mounds. Dark chocolate and coconut. Ooh, that sounds awful. I don't like coconut or dark chocolate. Hi, River Song. Ah, missed you too. Yeah, I haven't gone. I didn't go live for about two and a half weeks. One through four. Can you guys hear my cat meowing? He wants out. But I'm not letting him out because as soon as I let him out, he's going to get upset and come back and then went back in because he's weird. Two. We got some Chi Chi's Thick and Chunky Mild Salsa. And one through three. cute sunny d i love these i think i actually needed a second one for my shelf yay so cute love the little the little containers all right you guys one or two one or two the bottles are definitely cute they did a great job too i mean the proportions are getting a little better as well i mean the proportions in comparison to each other not so much but they're getting like the actual size of some of the minis is getting a little bit smaller, which I like. You know, Carrie, I'm really not sure, to be honest. I don't know what I want from Series 4. And we got some extra detergent. Very cute. I love those bottles. And last but not least, we got a Juicy Juice. The real juice. All right, you guys, what's next? Toy, Disney, 
or series three. I'll have to look at my checklist for series four because I really don't know what I don't have. Carrie, now come to think of it. Meg, yes. Yes, absolutely. So I guess I really want the frozen moment burger is what I really want. And the Bitcoin bag. That would be cool. But I've got most of the others, to be honest with you. I mean, I'm still missing, like... Mm, I think I pretty much have all the commons. Except for ones that are in, like, a special box. Yeah. I've got pretty much all of them, except for Frozen Moments, Golds. And then the Bitcoin bag. And hundreds. So, I've collected everything else from Series 4, crazy enough. I didn't realize I had already done so many. I need to fill my collector's case. Meg, I haven't... Okay, so I saw somebody post one on eBay for, like, something obnoxious. It was, like, $2,000 or something crazy. It might have been more, but, I mean, I, I just remember it being an outrageous number. But, so it does exist. I just, I haven't seen anybody actually open one on live or anything. Ready? Bam! All right, y'all. One through five. I really want the Bitcoin bag, though. That would be really cool. I'd be stoked about that. Let's open one. We got a Hershey's strawberry syrup. Very cute. One through four. I do collect foodies. I've collected a lot of the foodies, but I have a lot more of those to collect. Like, I don't even have... I might have half of them. I've got a lot more of those to collect, though. Especially the rares. Like, I've collected, like, one rare or two rares, maybe, I think. The rest of them I still need to find. Mmm... No, I take it back. I'm looking at my checklist now, and I think I've got, like, probably 70% of the collection done, minus the rares. I know, Meg. Isn't that crazy? River Song, thank you so much for the gift. You're so sweet. Hi, Michelle. Hi, your girl, Rena. We got some cool whip original. Thank you so much for the gifts. You guys are so sweet. Whoops, it dropped. All right, you guys, one through three. Yep, we still got quite a few more to collect for foodies. I don't have as many of those on hand, though. I have some, for sure. I just don't have as many of those as I would like to have. Two is... Checklist. And... Some Zatarans. Jambalaya, I believe. Yes, Jambalaya. All right, you guys, one or two, one or two. Number two is Swizzles Sweet Shop. I have never actually seen these in real life. My husband saw jambalaya stuff today when we were looking for groceries. 
And, oh, I dropped it. I remember when this first came out in Series 2 Wave 2. So cute. I love this little container. So adorable. Is it European? I don't know. I'm not a huge candy person though, so I'd probably never buy it, if I'm being honest. I don't judge people that eat candy by any means. My husband loves chocolate. Ready? Bam. But I'm just not personally a sweets person. I never have been. It's just not something that I like crave all the time. My Except for, I love cinnamon. I do love cinnamon. All right, you guys, one through five. Hey, Charlie. Hey, buddy. What's going on? What's going on, handsome? Number five is we got a cute little mini bag. Mini Mouse. Arlene, I haven't been able to find any. I checked both of mine. And we got Minnie Mouse. <laughs> we got a Minnie Mouse figure to go with the Minnie Mouse bag. Checklist. Oh, <laughs> Mickey Mouse and his remote control car. We are just mouse themed today. I needed another one of those, actually, weirdly enough. This does seem like a theme ball. I was going to say, if this is Minnie Mouse related, if this is the Minnie Mouse phone, I was going to laugh. And we got this Beast. The Beast. There's something sweet and almost kind. And he was mean and he was coarse and unrefined. And now he's dear, but so unsure. I don't know why I didn't see it there before. Whoops, knocking things over. All right, and the tour. I do. I enjoy that movie. You know what movie I want to watch? That just made me think of animated movies. I want to watch Quest to Camelot. I know. Listen, the alien. I, do I still have it? When I was when I opened it, it fell out. Like it just fell off of its little case thing, and he just looked cute like that. So I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna leave him. You asked if I collect Minnie's fashion. I do. Purple shelves. They are from Amazon, Walmart, and Ross's. There's a link in my bio to my Amazon storefront. If you want to look, they're just utensil trays turned sideways and painted. All right, you guys. Thank you all so much for joining. I had so much fun. Um, keep an eye out. I will post shortly the video for the night. And I hope to see you all soon. I love you all bunches. Bye, guys.